here on behalf of Zoku Salon, and I am here to tell you what is in your color to go curbside pickup kit. So you will be receiving, we finally got the bottles from Amazon. So two vessels, A and B, or you're going to be receiving a syringe. I do not have the syringes in yet. I'm waiting on Amazon, but they will look something like this, but a little bit bigger. It depends on what we mix for your color, what type of bottle you're going to get, but they will be labeled A and B. You take A and B and you mix it into your bottle. You put your finger over the hole and you shake to mix. You will be getting a set of gloves, barrier cream that you put around your hair frame that I explained in the other video. And um, that's it. The one thing I did not talk about in the other video is how to secure your towel. So you can just wrap your towel around your neck to protect, blah, 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 protect your clothing and your countertops and floors at home and all that jazz. You can use a rubber band and that'll secure it. Or if you have a clip at home, you can use a clip. Um, after you process your color for 30 to 40 minutes, you rinse your hair. If you have highlights, be careful how you rinse. You may want to bend over your tub just to preserve some of the highlights because at least they'll be at a 90 degree angle um, and it will help preserve. But rinse, shampoo, condition, and if you signed up for the dual senses, this is the dual senses, you just snap off the top and <laughs> the liquid flows into the bottom, you shake and you apply it to wet hair and it's a leave-in and that is it. Now I'm gonna show you where you'll be picking up the color. So this is how you're gonna be picking up the color. This is the alleyway between the barbershop and all the Okay, we're gonna drive this way. Come on, drive! It's Zoe Cortez coming to you from my bathroom. Um, Zoku Salon and myself wish you all that you're healthy and hanging in there. Um, we are creating these color kits to help you get through the next, I hope it's a few weeks, but it might be longer than that. Um, you will be receiving two lotions lotion A and lotion B that you mix together in this vessel. I do not have lotion A and lotion B currently because we're waiting on Amazon for the delivery of the product. So I'm going to do the video to show you how to apply it. And then when I get the product, I'll do another video to show you what will be in your bags. So in your bags will be lotion A, lotion B in a bottle or a syringe another bottle to mix both of the A and B into, and some protective lotion so you don't get staining. Um, I recommend that you brush your hair so you don't have any tangles or knots before you start. There'll be enough lotion or product to cover your frame, your part, maybe a side part, depending on how much hair you have. And then maybe you can do your back frame if there's enough product left over. So what I would recommend is to first cover your bathroom with towels and whatever you can, because if the color gets on the walls, it can stain it. So just be careful, wear an old t-shirt, um, take your jewelry off, no earrings. And I'm doing it in the bathroom because I'm sure if you're going to be doing it solo, you'll be doing it in your bathroom too. I'm also going to do one on my daughter in the kitchen. So if you have somebody to help you, it would be a lot easier. So first I'm going to take the protective cream and I'm just going to protect my base area around the frame. And you want to be sure not to get this on the hairline because if you have any gray that's close to your hairline, it won't cover. And remember guys, oil repels oil and our color has a lot of emollients in it. So if your hair is the least bit oily, it will repel the color. 
So please do it on clean, dry hair. Here is my lotion. So I'm gonna start at my root because once I get to my frame, I'm gonna be tilting down and I don't want my frame to be dripping into my eyes. So please be careful of your eyes also. So get to the color to the front and I'm going to start to apply the color. And you could use your thumb to just move it down a little to wherever your regrowth is, trying not to overlap. I'm actually gonna use the nozzle and I'm gonna go from back to front to separate the hair. in one eighth inch sections. And then I'm gonna apply again. You could use your forefinger or your thumb. Now guys, this is an at-home application. You may leave marks, we call them holidays. The, ho the color took a holiday from the hair. That's okay. This is just to get you through the next few weeks until you can come in for your professional full color touch up with your colorist at Zoka Salon. So I'm gonna take another section because I do wear a center part and a side part. I'm gonna apply and then I'm gonna tap it with my finger. Unfortunately guys, High lift blondes are not an option for at home color. It's too risky. There could be a lot of breakage and damage. I'm really sorry for that. I wish I had a solution for you. So I was able to get my center part and my side part and the rest of the camouflage. So I'm gonna flip that back over I'm gonna go in a little deeper into my next side, in case the wind blows, not that we're going out to see anyone. How crazy is this, guys, right? I keep feel like I'm in a dream. Christine and I knew it was coming, though, from watching our friends and family from overseas. All my friends in Italy and France and all of her friends in Asia was really scary. We closed the salon a full week before they mandated salons to close in New Jersey. And because of that, we were really busy the Saturday before the week we closed. So our supply stock is very limited and the warehouses are closed. So we even have a limited amount of stock. So we hope that the amount in the kits you guys will get you through like I said, until we see you again for your full touch up. Okay, so that's about all I'm gonna apply to my part area. Now I'm gonna do the frame because you have to tilt your head back a little. I wanna do this last. I know in the salon guys, sometimes I do this first because of those pesky grays, but because you're doing the, this at home, I don't want you to tilt down and get the color in your eye. And because I'm wearing my hair up all the time, I'm gonna do a back frame. And this I'm kind of, <laughs> if you have a two-way mirror, that would be great. I'm just gonna try to feel for where my frame is. The things we do. Well guys, you know what? This is my manga making America gorgeous again. I can't wait until we're back in the salon. Me and all the staff and Christine, we're always on a, a house party or a face party and we're laughing and we're trying to cheer each other up and send each other jokes and memes. Hi guys, so I'm back. 
back here is Andra, and I'm going to be doing her hair in my kitchen. So if you have someone at home that can help you, it would be much easier to do that. So again, in the kit, you're going to have a set of gloves. You're going to have barrier cream, lotion A, lotion B that you're going to mix together into this vessel. You're going to shake it. And then you're gonna to start to apply, but I forgot to put the barrier cream, so that's what we're gonna do first. So you're gonna apply the barrier cream just around the frame. Again, make sure that you don't get it on any of the hair. I mean, yeah, any of the baby hair or the scalp, because that's where all those little fine gray hairs are. And if you're going from dark to a little bit lighter, it won't lighten the hair because the cream is there. So again, just like before, I'm gonna start on her root area and I'm going to bead down a line of color. I'm gonna use my thumb to just spread it out. I'm gonna use the nozzle and I'm gonna separate the hair with my ring finger because there's no color on that, but there is color on my thumb. one eighth inch sections. Andrew also wears a side part, so I'm gonna try to go as far down I can to her side part, but again, she could also wear a center part if she's going to wear her hair in braids. Then I'm going to catch her hairline. I know I didn't do the other hairline yet, but that's because I'm not on that side of the body yet. Then I'm going to flip to the other side. Each side feels a little different. We always favor either the left or the right, so it is a little awkward for whoever's going to be applying it, again, because they're not professional. You could use a comb in between, but it's pretty cumbersome to Put the color on and put the color down, pick the comb up, section out the hair. I think it's just easier to use the nozzle of the container. Now, if there's product left over and you guys wanna go a little bit deeper into the hairline, you can go about two inches back. I know I didn't do that on the other side, but I will make it even. And because Andrew wears her hair up a lot, I'm gonna do a back frame on her as well. So just behind the ear, down to the nape of the neck. Now let's make the other side even because I didn't do it on the other side. I know I make this look very easy because I do this all day long on, you know, 20 something heads. Just be patient. You don't have to go as fast as I'm going. Actually go kind of try to go slow because the color can really fly. So again, make sure you protect your countertops, your floors. And then I'm gonna do her back frame. And that's it. That is a partial root touch up. She'll process for 30 minutes. I'll shampoo and condition her hair. 
I'll put a root locking serum in if you guys are interested in those. We can uh, put those in your kits. And that's it. And until we see you, I hope we see you really, really soon. Thanks. Calls from you have any questions. If you were a client that had requested the dual senses conditioning treatment for after your color, so after you rinse, shampoo, and condition, you towel dry. This is the dual senses. There's a few different formulas. You snap off the top. There is a mechanism here where you twist it, push, and all the liquid comes down into the bottom. Give it a little shake and then disperse through your hair and it's a leave-in. So you don't have to rinse this out. So we hope that these home coloring kits help you guys in this time. Feel a little bit better about yourself, bring some happiness into your life. Um, it's our first run, so I'm sure there's gonna be some growing pains the first week. I hope that it goes seamless. You guys will get the email, you fill out that form, that form comes back to us, then it shoots you back a video of me. <laughs> um, yeah, so if you have any questions, you can call me or Christine, that'll be on the email. Um, please try to apply your color within two hours of pickup. And um, we are all protected, everything is sanitized, we are quarantining ourselves. Um, I'm just with my family. As you saw, the pickup is going to be a drive-by, so the bags will have your name on it. And yeah, I hope it goes seamless, and I hope this helps. Um, any other questions or anything else I have to say? I don't think so. So we miss you. We can't wait to see you again. Like I said in my email, I see myself in overalls and a spackle knife and a spackle bucket covering all those grays and creatures. So.